Well, we're gonna make one of our family's favorite soups. And I actually got this recipe from one of our customers who's an awesome functional wellness doctor, and it's her version of soup Toscano. And so we're gonna start out with some Italian sweet sausage. I prefer chicken, but use whatever kind you want. We're gonna have some onions chopped, some fresh minced garlic, some russet potatoes that are organic, some fresh organic kale, red bell, I'm sorry, some red pepper flakes and some um, bacon bits, some organic cream or evaporated milk, and some veggie broth. So you put this together, oh my goodness, it's just wonderful. So we've got some Italian sausage. I snipped it open. You're just basically gonna scrape this away from the skin. And I'm doing about three. So while we've got a pound of that sausage cooking on about medium heat, I'm going to cut up a number two cone full onion. Get every bit of that out. I'm going to switch to the number one cone and we're going to mince some garlic. About one to two teaspoons. And I hold it vertically so I can get more of it in there. And we'll say that's about four cloves. We're going to give this a little stir, and don't worry, whatever's sticking will come loose once we pour the broth on there. Brown it and break it up. So I've got a straight edge um, bamboo spoon, and I'm just kind of chopping it up here. So you want to get it really small bits and pieces. So now I'm going to add the garlic and the onion and let those flavors work together. I'm also going to add my red pepper flakes and my bacon bits. I used about a teaspoon of red pepper flakes and a couple tablespoons of bacon bits. Give that a mix so the flavors are all together. Cover it. I'm going to do medium, click low. The flavors go and then we'll add the potatoes. So while we've got the onions, garlic, sausage, peppers and such going, we're going to cut some red organic potatoes on the number four and we're going to leave the skin on and then we're going to add that to our mix. And we're just going to pour those potatoes in there and give that a swirl with the other flavors of the sausage and the onion peppers. All of those good flavors working together. So we're going to cover it, do our medium quick low, lock in the flavor, lock in the vitamins and minerals, and then we're going to prepare our broth. So while that's going, you can make a really quick easy broth if you don't want to make your own from vegetables. I took some Better Than Bouillon Vegetable Blend. Um, you can use a liquid aminos, uh, just whatever bouillon, but about five bouillons or so cubes or teaspoons worth to about 10 or 12 cups of water. And then once this is clicked and we let that go, we're going to let that go for about, I'm gonna say 20 minutes so the potatoes are tender and the flavors worked in. We'll just add this broth afterwards and let it continue to simmer. So it's time to add our broth. It's been about 20 minutes. All those flavors are there. And we're just gonna add our cup of cream in there. And this is the very end, and that's when you're gonna put your kale in. You can tear it up into smaller pieces than this if you want. And we're just gonna let that sit in there for just a couple of minutes and serve, and it is so beautiful. And here's our finished soup, all ready to eat. Bon appetit.